In the ever-evolving landscape of programming languages, two names often surface with a certain sense of veneration, Rust and Go. Emerging from the labs of Mozilla and Google respectively, these two languages hold a strong grip on the hearts and minds of developers around the world. Rust, a systems programming language, focuses on safety, speed, and concurrency. It aims to provide the power and performance of C and C++, but without their notorious pitfalls. On the other hand, Go or Golang is a statically typed, compiled language known for its simplicity, efficiency, and strong support for concurrent programming. Now let's dive into the strengths and weaknesses of these two languages. Starting with Rust, its major strength lies in its memory safety guarantees without sacrificing performance. It allows developers to write high-performance code with a low risk of crashes or security vulnerabilities. It's a language that refuses to compromise on control and performance. However, Rust also presents some challenges. Its steep learning curve is often cited as a major hurdle. Rust's syntax and concepts like ownership and lifetimes can be unfamiliar and intimidating to newcomers. Moreover, Rust's compile times are relatively slow, which can slow down the development process. Switching gears to Go, its simplicity is its crown jewel. Go's straightforward syntax and clear language specifications make it easy to learn and read. It's a language designed for clarity and simplicity, making it a favorite for back-end development and microservices. Go also shines in its support for concurrent programming. Its goroutines and channels make concurrent programming more accessible and less error-prone. Furthermore, Go has a robust standard library and excellent tooling which can boost productivity. However, Go isn't without its drawbacks. Its simplicity can sometimes be a limitation. Go lacks some features that are common in other languages, like generics and exceptions. This can lead to verbose code or workarounds that can make the code less clean and harder to maintain. Additionally, Go's garbage collector, while convenient, can cause performance issues, particularly in latency-sensitive applications. In summary, Rust and Go both have their unique strengths and weaknesses. Rust offers control and performance with a focus on safety, but its steep learning curve and slow compile times can be deterrents. Go, on the other hand, stands out for its simplicity, strong support for concurrent programming, and excellent tooling, but its lack of some common features and potential performance issues with its garbage collector can be drawbacks. Choosing between Rust and Go depends on the specific needs and constraints of your project. Both are powerful, modern languages that have a lot to offer. The decision ultimately comes down to which language's strengths align best with your project's requirements and which language's weaknesses you are willing to navigate.